Hi guys, I'm Matt with Mr. Matt Woodworks and today I'm going to be talking about star bond adhesives. Now before we get started, I do have to let you know that they did send me this, but before they sent me this, I was already buying the stuff in bulk. So it's safe to say that I already love this product long before they sent this to me. So what is this stuff exactly? It's a cyanoacrylate adhesive, basically like a super glue, but they have this awesome stuff in here called Accelerator that when you spray it on the glue, it sets up almost immediately, which comes in very handy on the projects that I'm using it for. The glues range from thin to thick, and today we're gonna to be focusing on the medium in brown. Problem number one would be pinholes in wood. Here I've got a piece of oak that has seen better days, but it's got a bunch of these little dots, and if you get close, you can actually see that these are teeny little pinholes caused by these little borer beetles. Now, before I was using Starbond products, I was trying to fill these with epoxy, and that led to a whole host of its own issues. Sometimes these things would just go really deep, and it would take multiple pours to kind of fill everything up, or I'd pour it on there, there'd be a little bead that would develop on top. I'd think that I'm good. The next day when I sand everything back, it is still there's still a hole there, basically an air bubble. It's the, the epoxy was too thick to go down into the hole to fill it. And how do you get down those holes? With these little things. Starbun has these great little tips that fit over the larger glue end tip that comes with the bottle. So you can get really far down in these tight little spaces. Excellent camo work here, excellent. You had one job to do. Anyway, squeeze it down in there, give it a little spray of the accelerator. Once that sets up, you can fill it up a little bit more. Since this is the medium thick and not the super thick stuff, I did have to do two uh, applications of this stuff. It only takes a few moments. And then as soon as it's done flashing off, you're good to go for sanding it. You can see here, it's already hard, can't pick it off. So we give it a little sanding and it's flush with the surface. You can see here with that toothpick, the holes are now filled up. And then I'll wipe it with a little bit of water just to kind of clean it up. And if you're using a darker colored stain, it's gonna to help to hide the color of these holes. But like I showed you at the beginning, there are different tints that Starbond offers for these uh, to match different stains and wood types. Problem number two would be micro checks in the ends of boards. Sometimes you have a board that's the exact length you need it and a check develops, or you just, you can't afford to cut off that extra inch. So that's where this stuff comes in real handy there too. All right, so here you can see a little check in the end of this piece of walnut. And with that super fine tip, I'm able to get that star bond medium thick down in that crack. Now this was a very thirsty crack, so it took a few applications to fill this thing up. But again, with that accelerator, this process was really quick. I think I did all of these in just under a minute. Give it the fingernail test to make sure that it is indeed hard, and it is. So we're on to the sanding. After a little bit of sanding to make sure that it's flush, then a little bit of water to wipe away the dust and see how it's gonna look with a little bit of stain or finish on it. And that's it. And problem number three would be little knot holes on the face of your working piece, uh, little spots that you can't work around and you don't wanna have a void, so you can fill it with this stuff. At this point in the journey, this process is no longer a mystery. All we're gonna do is fill this void with the star bond adhesives. We are going to spray some accelerator on it. Once it hardens up, we can add a little bit more if it's needed. If it's not, you go right onto the sanding and you're good to go. Now in this example, what I like is that you can actually see, and this is shot in real time, this isn't sped up, you can see the accelerator working its magic and hardening everything up. And it, again, it only takes just a few moments. It's pretty cool to see. Fingernail, sand, wipe it, good to go. Now you don't have to wipe it with water. I just like to see what it's gonna look like with a little bit of finish on it, but you do you. But that's it. All right guys, well that finishes up our demonstration for the medium thick, which is my go-to for cracks and checks and pinholes and knot holes for wood filling. Uh, a huge thank you again to Starbond for supporting this channel and making this video possible. If you're interested in purchasing any of their products, head on over to starbond.com. And as a little added bonus, you can use the Mr. Matt promo code to get you a little bit of a discount. That also helps to support our channel, so you know any kind of support is greatly appreciated. Be sure to like and share and subscribe and do whatever it is that you do. Comment down below if you have any questions. Stay tuned for more reviews and demonstrations for the thin and the thick and everything else in between. We'll catch you in the next one. Y'all have a good one. Bye.